And we're back. I took a way longer break than intended because I want to watch the end of the F1. So, hello everybody. My name's Berg the Redneck Viking. Welcome back to Death Stranding Direct Destroy. Um, last time, we, uh, you know, we got Mama to, her pos to where she needed to be. And we hooked up some people, but sadly, we lost uh, our darling BB. The clients requested that you complete this order as soon as possible. In other words, speed will determine your eval. Mm -hmm. Keep anymore. in mind, however, that when operating outside network coverage, you won't be able to fabricate additional items. You'll need to choose carefully from the equipment provided by the client. Now, the clock won't start until you set out. So... Take your time to get your gear in order before you do. I wonder actually, can I reach any of the ones that are down there from here? Order assigned. Delivery parameters updated. Time limit set. Hello, Dad. Sam, in light of the patient's condition, I've gone ahead and put a time limit on this order. You can still deliver the cargo after it runs out, and I want you to move Helen Earth to get there before it does. I know we keep piling things on you, but your BB unit can wait a little longer. And besides, beating up the carbon right. network there should help it get better faster. Why can't I build these outside the carbon network? It might look a lot easier. I'm gonna drive to this other one. Because hopefully, this one is connected. This one can reach all the way down. I can't. I'm fine. Hello, Sam. If it's with car reach, I'm going to be annoyed. Rather than having to deal with the goddamn PP. I can't! Damn it. I need one down there. I need one there. How can I not reach that one? Okay. No idea. Oh, geez, that one. Oh, I don't. There we go. Here's the plan. Here we go. Oh, come on. Here we go. Now I can just avoid all the BG. Construction complete. Perfect. 
see if we can't pull this off. Because that one has been upgraded. So if I can somehow see that one from over here, I can just uh, kill them zip line over. There. Access the delivery terminal. I know how this works. Scanning bridges. Uh, you die hard man. Verifying ID. Clear. Weapons detected. This is quite a few times. Oh, no. There you are. The Mountaineer just contacted me. The treatment I prescribed isn't working. We need to act fast. I hoped the antibiotics would alleviate the worst of the symptoms, but... It looks like we're past that stage. An infection like this so late in the pregnancy can cause any number of complications. Mm -hmm. So the less you talk, Even the quicker you get out there. There is a risk she could suffer brain damage. Even brain death. Now, I need you to deliver this prototype bioprinter and remote medical terminal to the Mountaineer. If you can connect them to me via the chiral network, I can use this equipment to diagnose the patient's condition and provide treatment. The terminal will allow them to transmit their genetic okay, code hurry up. with which I can formulate a DNA vaccine for printing. Mm -hmm. At present, only vaccines utilizing viruses I don't care and about other non-living components Let's go. can be generated in this fashion. But future advancements may free us of this limitation. You it Sam should and go I without do saying, but this is delicate equipment. Yeah, Don't yeah, break yeah, yeah. I whatever know, you I do. Know, I know, I know. Oh, and uh, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, here we go. Bye bye. Uh, I'm not going to see it from here, am I? Have a pleasant journey. Weapons restrictions lifted. I'll do. right here I think On, baby. This is why these are unbelievably helpful. Oh, wait. Yeah. 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 Uh, thank you. I'm also. Uh, throwing the 
about sunglasses. Oh, you know what? No, we'll go Johnny sunglasses. We're gonna go pick up uh, the other structure. Okay, uh, an all-terrain uh, all one may have been a good idea. Uh, oh, that's the I think. Oh, is this one built by... No, it's built by someone else. And yet, there's always the... Uh, always this guy here pointing the direction. I remember that being a thing in the brief. Don't worry, buddy, I got you. We're gonna save your wife. Almost there. Come on, Sam. You can do it. Oh, no, I know. I agree. Oh, I know. I hear you. Don't worry. I'm almost there. Time she actually does die. I've seen that in the outfit, look. Delivering cargo. You're here. Oh, thank God. I'm indeed. She's barely holding on. It's a good thing you hurried. Now, let me join you up to the, uh, the UCA so you can actually Is that an S? Oh, damn, I didn't think that was gonna be an S. Sweet. Let's hook you up, baby. The doctor said we need a chiral connection for this to work. So, hook us up. We'll join the UCA, whatever it takes. Go ahead. <laughs>
how it goes. I think I did unlock those the last time. I just I don't think I've ever used the power gloves. Doctor, uh, okay, I'll I'll activate the terminal from my end. Just just a moment. Everything's going to be all right. With this device, I I can examine her as if I were actually there. The manipulators on the terminal perfectly reflect my movements here. And with the bioprinter, I can provide a custom-made vaccine. Hmm. It's just a shame my better half hasn't had a chance to build any more of these things. You're looking at the only ones we have. Don't worry, though. We'll do everything we can to ensure your child is safely delivered. Oh, thank you. This is... this is incredible. You should thank him. The network he's helping to build is going to change the face of medicine forever. All right. Let's have a look at you. Bye. You've brought us the next best thing to a live-in Dr. Sam. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Hey, Dad, Nicely man. done. BB-28 will be back in action soon. The kid's a real trooper. Stay the course, Sam. Heads up, Sam. Got a fresh order for you from a certain mountaineer. Oh, God damn it. It'll take you to a region not yet covered by the chiral network. Can I have baby back, please? Suffice it to say, this is a chance to change that. Look into it as soon as you can. Can I please have baby back? Good work. New order of it. Is this up to... Oh, it's the f photographer. Oh, okay. Hell yeah. I don't remember what power gloves are. Oh, here we go. Oh, you're gonna love power gloves. They provide a major oh, boost I do to remember. arm and grip strength. If you're scaling a cliff with a rope, you'll be able to make your way to the top a lot faster. You'll also notice a difference when lifting heavy cargo. And that's not all. Ever take a tumble down a steep slope? You probably tried to slow your descent with your hands, right? Well, if you've got these on, you'll be able to stop yourself that much more quickly. Just promise me you won't try punching someone, okay? That's not what they're for. I don't think I ever use these. I need PCs. outside the door so I can jump on quickly there and to get back up here. Uh, what's in this shelter? Eh, some stuff. Oh, no. Weapons restrictions lifted. Keep on keeping on. I just straight up copped into the mic. I didn't mean to. Played my throat. Construction complete. 
Right. Let's get going. different playthrough of them, like, really. like I like streamlining streamlining the process from going and building the roads ahead of time but this part I I'm I'd rather not be using this one the entire time in terms of like main gameplay when it comes to delivering stuff ow Eyes open, dumbass. How much damage did that take? Ah, that took actually kind of a big chunk. That's annoying. And a bit, when people stuff put stuff in certain places, I do think it's very dumb. Like this. You don't need a time fall shelter here. The, the bridge's shelter is right there. So, I'm um, actually going to dismantle this. Oh, bye. Structure dismantled. Put this here. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. I remember this being an annoying thing as well. The last one of this. So oh, I'll just shove it. Yeah. Cool. Right. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Let me go grab a vehicle quickly. All weapons will be locked until departure. All clear. Head on. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Decontaminating soon. Keep on keeping All clear. Keep on keeping on. Sam Porter Bridges. Hi guys. Construction. Uh. Build a bridge. Even This bridge might be destroyed. Oh, this actually doesn't make the bridge get destroyed once, uh, once I build the road. And it's very helpful now that I've connected all these areas to the barrel network because now when I build the bridge, I don't need to build it entirely myself. Ooh. You're new. What's in you? Ah, eh, not much though. I 
I know, I know, I know, I know. I believe. It's over there, right? Yeah. It's towards the BTs. So, it actually might be better to get in on the point. Just because of the Bridges, right? I am. You don't have anything else for me, do you? Not that I know of. No? Okay. Never mind. Did were you expecting something else? I remember you expecting Never anything. thought I'd receive a delivery in such excellent condition. Well, I did kind of fuck it up, but uh, thank you. Uh oh, going ass though. Alright. I have a favor to ask. See? Do you think you could find my father's camera for me? Yeah, I can try. It's kind of a long story, but he used to conduct field research in the area. My father believed that the key to understanding the Death Stranding was hidden here, somewhere in the caves and strata. But he passed away before he could complete his work, leaving me to finish what he started. And not long ago, I found something, something amazing. I was sure it was what my father had been looking for, even if I couldn't see how it related to the Death Stranding myself. What I needed was an expert opinion, someone who could look at what I'd found and tell me what it meant. So, I grabbed my father's camera and set out to document my discovery. Took pictures of every last detail. But on the way back, I spotted a group of armed men and I panicked. Dropped everything and ran like hell. Of course you did. Thankfully, they never saw me. But when I stopped running, uh, I realized the camera was gone. Case and all. I've been trying to pluck up the courage to go and look for it ever since. But then I remembered that the cargo tag was still on the case. And I figured you being with bridges and all that... You might have a way to pinpoint its location. I can certainly try. Please. I'd give anything to have it back. I'm going to put in the order. Please understand, that camera means everything to me. Until I know it's safe, I can't think about anything else. That's a lot of talking. There's a terminal there you can use if you want to get started right away. Here. It's what I'd take if I were going myself. Knock yourself out. Uh, you gonna give me a sticky gun? Good work. Yeah, I figured it. I'd be going into the hub. They're at cool area. Ah, 
I'll take that stuff. Order assigned. Thinking that he like even when he's not got BB, he doesn't put anything on the front. The front. All right, here's the plan. I'm gonna charge it. Try and avoid the uh, machine gun. Time to go stealth, boys. You know what would be very helpful right now? A goddamn sticky gun. Far away for you to hit. I need it, right? Yep. That was indeed all I needed. You're welcome. I was afraid I'd never see it again. Was, you know, and I'm not gonna go open a window because it's real warm in here. Oh, thank God. It looks uh, exactly like it always did. Oh, you don't know what this means to me.
Go. And as well as opening the window to get a little bit of air in here, Loki has left the building. Sweet. Hi. It was my father's idea to move all the way out here. He thought he could get to the bottom of the Death Stranding all by himself. And we were right behind him. But look where it got us. If you hadn't come along when you did, the camera would be gone, and all our hard work would have been lost before anyone had a chance to see it. <laughs> we can't let that happen. The world needs to hear about this. Someone out there will know what it means. So, connect us up. We want to be a part of the UCA. You got it. truly hope our work will help to make a difference. Thanks again. You're welcome. I hope we get to meet again before too long. Hey, Hartman. Hartman. That camera you recovered oh, contains wow. some fascinating footage. The data stored on it was automatically shared with us after you added the photographer's shelter to the network, along with her father's research materials. Anyway, my lab still doesn't have a high-speed chiral connection. But I was able to check one of the images against a database at HQ. Based on my preliminary calculations and the photographic and documentary evidence in our archives, I would estimate the paintings to be in the region of 30,000 years old, hmm. if not older. The artists were likely Neanderthals or other precursors who were migrating across the continent. See the dolphin like creatures there? At the time, the cave would have been situated even farther from the coast than it is now. Hmm. So how could the artists possibly have encountered dolphins? Answer? They couldn't. It is my belief that they had a brush not with dolphins, but with beach things. And that would mean the Death Stranding is not the first phenomenon of its kind. That it has happened before. Since the birth of our planet, countless species have gone extinct, from bacteria to dinosaurs. Scientists refer to the largest known mass extinctions as the Big Five. But there have, of course, been many other extinction events, albeit on a smaller scale. What if the artists were trying to document one such event, that of their own extinction? It would be the first record in Earth's history of a death stranding. And it would also lend credence to my theories. The sooner you come and connect me to the network, the sooner we'll know. Just Got imagine it. the mysteries we'll be able to solve. Can I get BB back I'm first? waiting, Sam. Wonderful news, Sam. BB ready? BB28's vitals yes. are nearly within optimal operating parameters. Just before I called, it opened its eyes. Up. It was Lose looking all over, as if searching for someone. And then, our eyes met. For a moment, I think. I tell you. It was almost enough to make me want to keep the kid for myself. No, that's my kid. Anyway, I still need to run diagnostics and make adjustments as needed. However, the fluctuating local chiral levels could pose a problem. Think you can bring one more site into the network? Damn it! Once you have, and once I have subsequently confirmed that BB is functioning reliably, I'll release it into your custody. This is the last step. I promise. Just one more site. That's all we should need. Good luck. Give me back BB, damn it. Good work. New. Uh, fine. Sam. Yes. I see you received a mail from our mountaineer friend. Seems he's got an order for you. Oh. Might be good to give it a look. Let's do it. I guess quickly look at my mail.
Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. Cool. Now, can I, once I bring this online, can I get these back to me? I turned off quite so quick, I looked away. And away we go. Hit a oh, I did hit a deep pack. Oh. Luckily, this one's here, I can grab. Yeah. 
So yeah, this time I'm just gonna keep going there, like a uh, piggyback. How long that happens to take. Sam Bridges, there's someone we need you to deliver a package to. She's a strange bird. Mm -hmm. That lives even higher up in the clouds than we do. And the research she's doing, well, it's out there and then some. And we're talking straight up occult stuff, though she wouldn't be very happy hearing me say so. And she claims she's delving into the mysteries of the cosmos. That kind of sounds anyway, like Alpha I found this rock out in the mountains with a handprint on it. And when I mentioned it to her, she got all excited. I honestly don't know what kind of close encounter she it's thinks it signifies. But I was wondering if you could bring it to her for me. And joining the UCA has opened my eyes to a few things. Like how there are all these people out there trying to make sense of the Death Stranding in their own way. And sure, her ideas may sound like the ravings of a lunatic to me, but they clearly mean something to her. And I'd like to help her out. Hmm. With your assistance, that is. You'll find an official order on the terminal. It's interesting that the voice of the character is not the same as the actual... Like... The person they used for it. Uh, I have much grenades. So I think if I remember correctly, there are some, uh, BTs in this direction. Who the hell's was that? Sam. Oh, Lugna. It's just like the one at South Knot City. A vortex loaded with so much Chiralium that it's almost off the charts. No, oh, that's not Loch Ness. Slowly but surely, it's creeping closer to us here in Mountain Knot. At least that's what I think, but I can't see it. Not with the naked eye. Uh, mama? But the data doesn't lie. It's the same temporal phenomenon that you told me dropped you in a war zone. I told you. Mama. Uh, but that wasn't. The Cupid's limiter can handle most chiral spikes, but we didn't plan for another supercell. Another supercell? I told you it was the same as before. Mama, is that you? You got me, Sam. Mama! It's been a while. She's but back! Not really. Malingan, Lachna, we're the same. One body, one mind, one being. Yeah, I'll still call you no mama. Point trying to draw a distinction. Not in this world. We're all connected. Remember that. Okay, good. I've gone to the goddamn supercell heading my way. Say I should have bought a uh, a rope with me. This 
is a stone. Oh crap. Last push time. Last push. Oh boy, that's gonna be a sucky push as well. here.
There you go. Sam Bridges. I've been expecting you. Yep. The Mountaineer told me all about you. This handprint you brought me, or stencil as I prefer to call it, is a vital clue. Weird it hails okay. from an era long before the dawn of human history. I'm going to date it and lay bare the cause of the Death Stranding. Well, take it out, Gina, and when fella. I do, all the secrets of the cosmos shall be revealed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Can I just get back to Diggy, please? Did you know this mountain used to be a pyramid in ancient times? <laughs> it's true. I don't think you know what you you're talking about. You won't find a place closer to the beach than this. I don't know, maybe to the wellspring, a beach? A source of untold power. How else do you think that chiral network of yours works? But I Science. digress. Show me the stencil. Thank you. It's in excellent condition. Yeah, I, I trekked through it. The goddamn a blizzard for this, so I, I hope it's in good condition. Cool. Now, let me hook you up to the UCF, right. please. Connect me to the chiral network. Thank you. Oh, isn't her sister the, um, the cosplayer? Now I have everything I need to date the stencil. Once I have my results, I'll share them with you and your colleagues at Bridges. You've done a good thing, Sam. If you find anything else, be sure to bring it straight to me. I'll be waiting. You should take this. I'm certain that it will be of use to you in your journey. Oh, a new, uh... Thing. Could have given me anything. You give me this. Until we meet again, my friend. Deadman? Sam, it worked. Oh, thank you. BB 28 is in excellent condition. No evidence of lingering attachments or homesickness either. Perhaps its memory was erased after all. All that remains is for you to hook it up. Don't I have to go and get this from his home? I was hoping to return it to you as soon as possible, but... Uh, I don't want to. I mean, I do. But it's a little more complicated than that. What? We've got a problem. You may have heard about the massive supercell heading right for Mountain Not like City. I'm recording another episode immediately. I left my facility to perform some additional tests on the BB in the field. And now I find myself unable to return. You know the cabin on the mountainside, northeast of Mountain Knot? Mm hmm. Let's meet there. All right. Good work. Well, new order available. I can't get BB. Uh, well, that'll be it for this one. Um, we've connected a bunch of new places. We're about to get BB back. And, uh, and Sam is either freezing cold or doing some Hulk Hogan poses. Either way, uh,. It's been fun. We've got a supercell heading our way, and I think that means we're going to see old Mads again. So, uh, until the next episode, I hope you have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening, or just generally a wonderful day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.